Hey guys, it's your balloon man, Mr. Fudge, and we're here to make a helicopter, that's right. Now the helicopter I make uses two balloons. Uh, in this case, I'm going to use a yellow balloon, about a hand's length, and also a purple balloon, about a hand's length. So we're going to set one of those balloons aside, and we're going to start off with a one-inch bubble, followed by about a maybe three-inch bubble. Now at this point, after you twisted this, you can let go of the first bubble because there's still enough room to twist it later on. I then follow that with a one inch ear twist, just like so. Follow it a medium, small medium bubble, and a one inch ear twist. And then now at this point, we've got to retwist this bubble because we're going to have to twist um, to make another matching bubble and twist those together. So, retwist that one inch bubble. I hold that like so between my thumb and finger. And I reach across and try to make these even and pinch and twist like so. At that point, I have something like this. Squeeze up the end. Don't have to squeeze it all the way to the end. Just give it a squeeze so it's a little soft. At this point, I push this through the center. And that's going to be our helicopter, the, I want to say fuselage, the place where the pilot sits. Yeah. And then when you get to the end here, you're going to actually need to make a another propeller and the way I do it is I just make a motorcycle wheel and it looks like a propeller it fits in the same visual spectrum and it works so I make a one inch twist a bubble twist that off and the rest I squeeze up to the tip make a one inch bubble fold it over and get something like that now if you'd like to give it more of a helicopter shape you can shape this balloon by folding it pinching and letting go and getting a nice little curve to the end of the helicopter. So, pulling up our next balloon, the purple balloon. This is the actual chopper part of the helicopter. I squeeze it a little bit just to soften it. And then at this point, I just fold and twist and tie the nozzle around real tight and then push it through the center of that balloon because that actually helps hold it in place a little more. Then make another fold. Then make our final fold. And I'm just taking the tail of the balloon, whatever I had left, finding the nozzle, and tying them together so that I make sure it holds. At this point, we have like a ninja throwing star and like a weird sword, you know, but we're going to put those together and we'll have a helicopter. So we take the first bubble we started with and the propellers we made at the top. We're going to actually tie these propellers around. this one inch bubble and that becomes a our helicopter so thanks again for joining us it's your balloon man Mr. Fudge